Hua Jing is a is a style of of Chinese metaphysics, and it, it is not like any other style of energy. So in, in martial arts science, for example, we have in Chinese medicine, which are we're pretty much interchangeable. There's 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 a few differences, but for the most part, they've worked in tandem over the eons to create uh, the great healthcare system that they have today. But um, uh, just martial science doesn't usually like treat the general public, you know. Or if they do, they usually uh, they usually become a Chinese medical doctor. So um, anyway, so the Hua Jing style is not Qigong, it's not Shen Gong, it's not. Uh, and so Shen Gong would be like spiritual work, blessings, prayer, dousing, muscle testing. Um, it's not uh, Yi Gong, like psychic ability or projection of mind. Uh, it's a combination of all of these things and physical movement, what's called Li Gong. And all of these things make like ingredients. And so like you would take a look at a cake, and if I told you that this cake is actually made of like seven different ingredients, like it's made out of eggs, and it's made out of sugar, and water, and flour, you'd be like, no, nah, that's a totally, that's a thing, Look, like, it's a cake, that's a, that's a whole thing. And I'm like, no, no, you take all these things, and you mix them together in the right proportions, and then you expose them to heat for a long period of time, and then you get the cake. No, okay. And so it doesn't look anything like the original thing. And, and so, so Hua Jing energy means, or Hua, uh, yeah, Hua Jing in general means the mysterious power, because it's not Qi, it's not Shen, but it has all these little pieces of, of the techniques, and all together it makes its own thing. And so they just called it the mysterious power. And so it's not really that mysterious, at least not to me, because I've kind of figured out how all that stuff works. Uh, so, so and, I, and I can bring it to you. Uh, so the the Hua Jing twist is a is a way that you can stimulate uh, the Hua Jing type of energy to affect muscles, nerves, emotions, anything like that, all from a finger. A perfect example is I uh, ran into a lady the other day who had like terrible sciatic pain. I just happened to, to bump into her and I said, "Hey, you know, I can I can help you out with that." And I touched her finger and touched the sciatic area, and then less than 45 seconds, her whole sciatic nerve and stuff unlocked. And so I said, there, how are you doing? And she was like totally amazed that I could fiddle with her finger and it stopped all her sciatic pain in less than a minute. Yeah. And so, and, and it was pretty amazing. You know, I could feel all the muscles and nerves and stuff all opening up and, and just peeling apart like you would just take, take apart layers of an onion over that period of like 30 seconds. And so, um, so she was very appreciative. Uh, but the, so the, the Hua Jing style is its own style of, of less energy work in general. And uh, it allows you to cultivate and bend energy and, and form energy. And so it's a very, very, very high level. It's a grand mastery degree level technique in martial arts science. But I've taken it and extrapolated the properties of it and condensed it and compressed it down and said, okay, this is what makes it work. Just do that. You don't have to know how it works or anything. That's not important. It just works. You just do that and it'll work. And, and so if you want to know more about how it works, then you can come see me. All right, well, we'll spend some time on it. But right now, just, just take this and use it. And so it's much like how originally we had like computers, like the Commodore 64 and the old Apple and the Mac, you know, all that kind of stuff. And now then we had an operating system, you know? And then we had online stuff that was all complicated. And then America Online came out with their little interface. And so somebody basically just made, so instead of having to put in a disk and type in low, uh, uh, low quotation, asterisk quotation, comma eight, comma one. Okay, instead of having to do that, you just push the button and it kind of does that automatically, like a kind of a macro thing. And so it does loads all the information up and everything, and boom, it's there. And people are like, wow, I just clicked, you got mail. Oh, it even tells me when I got mail. And, oh, click that, it pulls up your email automatically, it logs you in with your password. You don't have to know anything. And so then you had a whole culture of people who went from like, computers are scary to, hey, I can do this. 